Hello! Today we're going to talk about least common multiple and using three different methods to find the least common multiple of any two or three numbers. The first method is listing the multiples. Let's say we want to find the LCM of 12 and 16. We can list all of the multiples of 12 and 16. That would be 12, 24, 36, 48, 60, 72. We can continue if needed. Multiples of 16 include 16, 32, 48, and oh, well, could you look at that? I've already found one that they have in common. The least common multiple of 12 and 16 is 48. Let's try finding the least common multiple of 12 and 16 by using prime factorization. You can use a factor tree to write the prime factorization of both 12 and 16. The prime factorization of 12 is 2 times 2 times 3. The prime factorization of 16 is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. This is where it gets a little tricky. We're going to circle anything that they have in common. Let's circle that one. So they have two sets of 2 in common. We're going to bring those down here. And then we're going to take everything else that they don't have in common and multiply that into our mix also. So we have a 3 a 2, and another 2. 2 times 2 is 4, times 3 is 12, 12 times 2 is 24, times 2 is 48. Our LCM, once again, is 48. Now, let's use the latter method to find the least common multiple of 12 and 16. Just like with GCF, we're going to use our upside down division sign and find a common factor. A common factor of 12 and 16 would be, mm, I can think of 4. 4 goes into 12 3 times, 4 goes into 16 4 times. Is there a common factor of 3 and 4? No. So we're going to look and instead of just taking our factors, we're going to think about this as an L shape and we're going to multiply everything inside our L. So 4 times 3 times 4. 4 times 3 is 12, 12 times 4 is 48. Our least common multiple of 12 and 16 is 48.